Hi everyone, this is Tammy, owner of Worthy, Worth It, and Priceless, and this podcast is titled, I Talk to Jagged Edge, like I really talk to Jagged Edge. So this is the story. It's probably going to be all over the place, but you'll get it. So either way, um, I got on, Jagged Edge has a radio station as well, and their radio station is stationhead.live forward slash Jagged Edge. And so they have a radio station every night at nine o'clock. And so I ain't going to go into the gist of it. I'll just get to the point of me getting on live with Jagged Edge. And um, I got on and I told them about my book and how they inspired one of the games, which is the game in the book that is No Lip, No Debate. Um, It was actually inspired by Jagged Edge and it is stated in the book as well. But um, the no lip part, I got it from Jagged Edge because they have a song that is called um, In Private. It's off of their album Hard. I think that's their fourth album. And um, on that song, in that song, they have Don't Trip, No Lip. So I took that no lip part and I created a, um, a game. And it's basically the game is for couples that you can't argue. Like if your mate asks you to do something, you can't argue or you can't give them basically no lip, no debate. Because I realize that a lot of times in relationships, and I can only say from a woman's standpoint or what I have done or whatever, but um, your mate may ask you to do something and you want to give them a hard time or you might give them a hard time instead of just doing it or whatever. And a lot of times men can't part- can't usually communicate what's going on in their minds or whatever, or, hey, I had a bad day. I just need you to do what I ask you to do. And not in a forceful way. No one's forcing anyone to do it. But, you know, like sometimes you have a hard day and you ask your mate to do something, and all of a sudden it's just like this whole big old argument. And it's like, okay, like, I can't do this argument with you today type of thing. And so that is what the gist of the game is. And um, anyway, I told Jagged Edge, and they were so respective, uh, like, they were so happy um, about it and everything. They actually wanted cards and everything, and um, so I'll let you know what happens with that. But um, what I wanted to give you guys encouragement on I know a lot of you guys have been following me and everything, especially if you follow me on social media and everything. I've been posting about Jagged Edge and everything and, you know, basically stating that they are my favorite group. And I have even talked to you guys about Jagged Edge on here. And um, I just wanted to give you guys encouragement just to keep going with your dreams because you never know how God is going to open up a door for you. Um, I had a feeling that I was going to possibly interact with them in some way shape form or fashion I just didn't know how and I didn't know how fast or whatever but the thing about it is always be open to whatever God has for you and don't be afraid now I will say this I was afraid all week I knew basically God placed it on my heart like on Friday um right after their show to call them and let them know you know about the book and everything but I ain't going to lie, I was nervous. I had anxiety all week. But when it came time for me to get on live with them, and it's so crazy because I talk to you guys like almost every day, and I'm not nervous to do this, but it, I was nervous as hell. But either way, as soon as I was on, you know, it seems like God just took over. And the words that I needed to say, they came out, and it was – it was beautiful. So don't be afraid to follow after your dreams and just keep going. Um, I will keep you guys updated on my journey and just to give you guys, continue to give you guys um, encouragement to keep going with your dreams because you never know how God is going to open up doors or whatever. So, yeah, that's my story. Uh, it'll probably be more detailed at another time, but as of right now, it just happened, so that's all the information that I have right now. But <laughs> um, I am just so happy. I'm so grateful to God. And so anyway, as always, know that you have worth. You have, um, wow, uh, you have worth. You have value. You are worthy, worth it, and priceless. And until next time, bye. Bye. 
Hi everyone, I wanted to update this podcast to give you the audio from my talk with Jagged Edge. So here it is. Who in here? Who in here? We got worthy words in here. Can you hear us, babe? Hello? 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 Who in here? (laughs) (laughs) How you doing? I'm fine. Oh, man, thank you for calling in. Thank you for listening to our show, man. You enjoying yourself? Uh, Yes, I am. Oh, thank you very much. Do you have the album yet? Yes, I have the album. I have all of your albums, digital and physical. Oh, man. Thank you so much, man. We appreciate that, I downloaded all of them on um, Apple and Spotify, and I listened to them on there, so y'all get y'all credit. No doubt. Love. Thank you so That's much, man. Love. We appreciate yeah. all the love. and We, and we ain't going to let you down, man. We're working on album number 11 as we speak. I heard already. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Brian uh, had an interview, and he said that you guys are working on 11 already. Exactly. Yes, exactly. Listen, um, you have any questions for us? Yeah, um, I actually... Um, you guys inspired me to make a relationship game for couples. I wanted to tell you guys about. That's oh, cool. that's what's up. That's what's up. What's, yeah. what's it called? So, uh, um, well, I wrote a book. It's called Love and Relationships, and it's out now. It's on Amazon. And then in the book, there is games for couples. Oh, and that's dope. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. And oh, so one man. of the games is called. Yeah, one of the games is called No Lip, No Debate. And I got the no lip part from your song in private where you put, where you say, um, don't trip, no lip. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's super creative. <laughs> yeah. That's super creative. So, I, I yeah. appreciate that. Oh, she's still going. No problem. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, um, <laughs> and then basically the part is, I know guys don't always know how to communicate with us or whatever. And sometimes you guys may ask us to do something and we give you guys a hard time about doing it. Mm-hmm. So that is the whole point of the card. Like you give your mate the card. Like, you know, I don't, you know, I, I can't have an argument right now. I just need you to do what I need you to do. And you're not yeah. forcing them to do it. I, I need, yeah, I need some of them cards. Oh, tell me. Fred asked me some of them cards. Oh, tell me. <laughs> <I> can, real. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. Look, my girl gonna be um, so mad that a, a woman made this. All <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. Because I seen Brandon, you had an interview. It was an interview years ago, and you said in the interview that you don't really like to argue. Oh. So <laughs> I, I can't do it too much. Like that, that's the one thing that'll turn me off on the whole relationship. We do that too much, um, I'm good. Yeah, I seen that in the interview, so I was like, this is a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Hey man, DM one of us, man. DM one of us on, on Instagram or something, man. So so we can so we can get 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 the cards and stuff, man. We wanna we wanna yeah, you know what I mean? That's a great idea. That, that's I awesome, that. man. Okay. Got you, no problem. Yeah, oh, for, sure, for sure, for sure. I have like somewhat of a question. I want to know your idea on this. Um I seen it that they stated that if a man is more into the woman than a woman is is into the man that the relationship would work. Mm. Do you guys think that same thing or no? I mean, as a I man, disagree. Like, how do you feel about that? I listen. I'm glad my brother said he disagreed, and I do too. But I will say this: I, I think that sometimes when when that's the the the, the semantics of the, of the situation, that a man being more in love with a woman sooner or later he'll turn that woman around in a sense still make her feel that same mm-hmm. thing but when it's the other way around like if, if the woman mm-hmm. is more into the man sometimes ain't nothing you can do to make that man right. get to where yeah. you are yeah yeah, yeah. Ooh, i it's... agree i concur yeah i do too <laughs> very well spoken but let me see about that <laughs> energy. Hey, 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 listen, though. No, so, so we're gonna go to go to another caller, but hey, we, we want to thank you, call, man. Thank you for calling in, man. And hey, make good sure luck with that game. I'm telling you, make sure you hit us, hit us, man, so we can try, try to get our hands on that game. And the book, I got you, no problem. All right. Okay, uh, th- All right. th- see you. All right, bye. <laughs> How you gonna start when you go in? <laughs> I, I said you patient. Well, you know, I'm ready to 